Praise God. God bless you in the name of the Lord Jesus. I am Moses Koride Are by the grace of God. I'm the president of Calvary Dharma Ministries International. And by the grace of God, I feature in many other evangelical films apart from Calvary films. The Lord bless you in the name of the Lord Jesus. We appreciate you. We appreciate your uh, your love for this YouTube cap, uh, YouTube channel, Calvary Movies TV. We thank God for how far the Lord has been using you to bless our lives. In terms of your prayers, a lot of you have been praying for us. A lot of you send wonderful messages and testimonies. And a good number of you send uh, your seed of faith to support the work we are doing in here. The Lord will reward you. I can say it very emphatically and very radically that the Lord God himself will reward you in the name of the Lord Jesus. Uh, well, um, we are about to show you something that I know will bless your life. We are going to, by the grace of God, show you if one of our films and then we we'll need to pray on that particular film. God is just telling me that there is a name for us to pray and uh, using that film as a tool of our prayers. Uh, the film is titled The Wicked Room. But I want to title it this time around that come out of the wicked room. Yes, come out of the wicked room. Come out of the wicked room. The wicked room of darkness, the wicked room of failure, the wicked room of sudden death, the wicked room of sickness of several years, the wicked room of, uh, of perplexity. A lot of evil are happening in the wicked room. A lot of names are now, as we are talking now, written in the wicked room. A lot of destinies are already in the wicked room. Please believe me. Believe me. The reason why you are experiencing this failure that we are experiencing right now is because your name is in the wicked room. But I have a good news for you, that the Lord God will use this film to deliver you totally. He has used it to deliver several people, and your home will not be an exception in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. So get ready to watch this mouth opening, wonderful soul delivery film, The Wicked Room. Samson, why are you crying? Why are you lamenting? You are lamenting. <sighs> this is not for you. I mean, this is not the type of day you should be crying at all. This is a day you should be joyful. Eh? Look at the great thing that the Lord has done for you. You are now a medical doctor. <laughs> Everywhere you go, you will now be calling you doctor. Doctor. Eh? Doctor. <laughs> and um, I have... Uh, ask your senior sister, I'm talking about my own only daughter, to prepare your special delicacy. Am oh, my special delicacy? <laughs> talking about panderiam mm. and a goosey soup mm. with oya meat, grass cutter. <laughs> you 
Pandu and dish your Pandu. And the Gusi. Yes. And Noya. Yes. Grass cutter. Daddy, I can't wait to eat it. As long as I had such a delicacy, you will eat and eat and eat. As a matter of fact, you will eat it continuously for the next few days you are going to spend with us. Daddy, daddy! 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 Banded yow! Bami, to say that my sister did a good job will be another statement. Our food is super delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie, honestly, I suppose to give you Chief Ketra of this nation. Thank you so much, Abromi, for appreciating my food. Eh, I wish I could do more. Auntie, let's that baby Lara. <laughs> honestly, I enjoy that food. <laughs> ah, you've done noble. <laughs> anyway. Uh, I understand you'll be staying over the weekend before you go back to the town. Precisely. If not for anything, to enjoy more of this kind of delicious food. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm, that's good. That means we will have time to chat and chat with the only medical doctor in our entire extended family. Huh? Let's thank God. Is that loves me? That is my friend now. You're yeah, welcome. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, Auntie. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, did you know? Uh, ah. Just, uh, just for, just for the charge card. Uh, Something. All this for me. Uh, just a little for ah, my. Thank you so much. Uh, just thank you. Ah, it's worth celebration. Uh, <laughs> How much is that? Uh, I'm a cool new. Ah, I cool new. Mami, we now compare those two thousand with that. That where 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 people are funded yam. Honestly, I I enjoy that food very well. Is that is that good now? We can go do ah. Can we see? And you can still give a two thousand naira. Mommy, please, please, just manage this one for pure water. Ten thousand naira for pure water. Ah, I am it, Dadile. I am it, Dapata Pata. Ah! <laughs> Thank you very much. My God will reward you. Amen. God will continue to lift you up. Amen. He will lift up your head above Amen. your equals. Amen. You will not fall into the pit dug by your enemies Amen. in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. You are my dafu enemy. Amen. Ah? Ten thousand naira of pure water. Hey, hello. I am it, Dapata Pata. Bami, you haven't seen anything. I believe God that when I begin to walk and hold my own hospital, you a whole hospital will become will be your own. By the grace of God. Eh? By the grace of God. Daddy, you will far more better and more delicious food than the one we just finished. Amen, oh Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name. Daddy, I will change your wardrobe. I mean, I will buy new clothes for you. By the grace of God, I will pull down this building. And on it, I will build a befitting edifice. For you. For me. Ah, ah, the boss is no good. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, ah. Kokuroma jen that no be to bo. This is this 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 is painful to me. It's painful to my heart. Bami, why you cry? You know, I'm thinking that my brother and his wife should have been around to enjoy out of this large largesses, great things that God is doing for you. I should be the only one that will enjoy it. As a matter of fact, they should enjoy it more than me. 
my shield. Ah! Bamis, you don't need to worry, sir. God knows everything. Then who are we to question whatsoever God permits to happen? Huh? After all, we are enjoying the blessings of God. That's that what appreciating God for. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God will keep you protect you and guide you in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Haduke? Haduke? Didi? Wake up! Wake up! in the night. Terror that visits in the night? I don't like that. I don't like you. Nobody likes terror. Terror comes in its own volition without being invited. By the way, how was your traditional wedding? It went on well. The Lord took control. Please go. I need to sleep. You will sleep. But not before I'm done with you. By the way, what sort of question is that? We met and we fell in love with each other. And after all said and done, we got married today. Keep quiet! You got married to another person's husband. You are in trouble! You are in trouble. Don't know me! Bah! Take what it. is it for? Keep out you and I let go that insert it into your genital deeply! Don't worry, your husband will not wake up. Insert what? Oh yeah, take it! I said I won't! Take it and insert it into your janitor. Deeply. I will never do such it. You will. I said I won't. You will. I said I won't. sort of a nonsense dream is that? Eh? That one monkey, one uh, demon, one black devil come and is asking you, you a living human being, eh? To take something and cover your 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 genital. Eh? And you to you, 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 you accept, you collect it from his hand and put it. You now have the effrontery, the temerity that uh, uh, you say you are not going to give back again. 
And you think me, Bola, Adebola, eh? We agree to stay with a barren woman in the same house. I pray that dream never come to pass. Pray. Pray if it is fasting, fast. If it is going to the mountain, go to mountain. Whatever you can do, go and do. That dream should not come to pass. Because me, Adebola, will not open my eyes and Talobo should enter. Eh? Women that put your head up and look at me. Yeah, you, you must. You, that is a joke. I will not agree. Oh, I will not take it. I'm telling you. No. Is it my fault? Ah, be asking me. My baby, Lord, Miss Obo. If it is my fault, if it is my fault, I will not. Good afternoon, Elder Enoch. Good afternoon, my daughter. How are you? Hey, uh, we didn't see you at last week's Bible study. You weren't around. Why, why didn't we see you, my daughter? Bami, I told the pastor I was tired and stressed up. Because of my condition, I need rest. Uh, that reminds me. It, 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 this is out of curiosity. Uh, uh, I was thinking that you... you you are supposed to have delivered some two months back. And we have not heard about the good news. What is happening? Hmm. I pray that the good news will come very soon. Elder, you need to intensify your prayers for me. Ah, this is the 11th month of pregnancy. Pregnancy that's supposed to last for nine months. This is the handiwork of the devil. This is the handiwork of the devil. Nine months old pregnancy now getting extended to 11 months. is the handiwork of the devil. But I want to tell you this. Jesus is on the throne for you and for all of us. And I know he will fight this battle and he will deliver in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Please, please make efforts come to this evening's Bible study. The Lord will bless you. Thank you, Elder. Well God bless you. My boy, good evening. How are you? How are your parents? I mean, your father and your mother. They are fine, sir. Oh, that's good. Congratulations. Congratulations on what? I heard that Dr. Samson came on a visit. The only doctor around here. We are proud of him. You have heard of, about the coming of uh, Dr. Samson? That's, that's very good. You are proud of him. And you are happy with him. But the truth is, he didn't achieve that just by his mental intelligence. He achieved that by the combination of his mental intelligence and the grace of God. That's the reason why you need God. It is God that can do everything for a man. Okay? Tell you. Uh, that reminds me. Uh, God will help you too. If you work hard and you pray hard and you serve God. Yes. So that reminds me. That how about Rhoda? Which Rhoda are you talking about? I'm talking about your mother, Rhoda. How is she? Please, uh, what is her Yoruba name? Ajike. So her Yoruba name is Ajike. That's right. That's good. Please tell her when you get home that I said she has to come to the Bible study this evening. And I want to see you there at the Bible study, okay? Thank you, sir. God bless you, my boy. Amen, sir. You are welcome.
what you saw was a very terrible dream. She inserts the piece of a broken pot into your genital. Since then, you have not been pregnant. Yes, man of God. <laughs> you can never be pregnant until that broken piece of pot is removed from your body. I tried. I made all my efforts. But all my efforts were effort in futility. It is not by power, nor by might, but by the Spirit, says the Lord. Man of God, please, what do I do? Please help me. Mm, sex. Pardon? I didn't hear you well. I said sex. I've been having sex with my husband since, but I didn't conceive. You can never be pregnant until you have sex with a powerful man of God that carries great apostolic anointing. Not ordinary man of God, but a firebrand man of God with power and fire to break bondages and set the captive free. A single sex with such a man will give you a child instantly. Hmm. Oh. Sir, please, where will I get such a powerful man of God? I don't know. Can you please help me? How? Can you do it? Uh, I don't think I can do it unless you insist. I don't think. I insist. Please help me. Help me. How many days will I come for it? Um, seven days. Mm, seven days. Seven days? Yes. Okay. When are we starting? Today, tomorrow, next week? We can start right away. Jesus Christ. And uh, subsequent days will be in the night. You can tell your husband you are going for a vigil. And that's all. Mm. Please don't rush me. Don't rush me. Is marching her and the gate of faith shall not prevail. <laughs> the church of God is winning, but the gate of faith shall not prevail. Um, you see, I actually came for four things, four different things, and I want you to help me. I'm all yes. Okay. Number one, you know that my younger brother, that my late younger brother, that short one. Yes, the short. Man devil, short man devil, pot bellied, short man devil. Yes. That is son, Samson. He came from the town. As a matter of fact, Samson is around now. And uh, he said, well, he has graduated as a medical doctor and he was bragging and boasting and bragging and boasting. He even has the infantry to tell me that and now he become a medical doctor. He has, I mean, now he has become a medical doctor and he will have plenty of money. He will get a good employment, he will get a good job and he will build a very big hospital. And we have money. And he kept on bragging. That when he has the money, he will be spending the money lavishly, spending the money anyhow. 
Twenty wasn't the case. Do you know what this boy told me? He said he will pull down my house, the house I labored so much to build. He said he will pull it down. He said that with his mouth. Eh? Ah! He has crossed his boundary. Exactly. That was what he said. Edda. I need to take you to somewhere. You mean apart from this place there's another way we can go? I make you move. Oh, oh we left for what? We go, we go, we go. This is my wicked. This is the place where I deal with the destiny of offenders. Look at this calabash. Omari Bai Lidi Toko. It belongs to Dupe. This is the story of Dupe. Dupe offended a Muslim neighbor. Hmm. And that lady brought her name and this calabash. After I've worked on it, on this calabash, since that day, she has been jumping from one husband's house to another husband's house. Till she died, she will continue jumping from one husband's house to another husband's house. Because Omari Ibaka. Still wet and even soapy for me, ah. and it will never go dry. Hmm. This is the sponge used to bat additional 47 years ago on his birthday. 47 years ago, and it's still at this fresh. It is the, it is the sponge of failure, bad luck, backwardness, extreme poverty. This is the first punch used in batting him. Hmm. Hmm. The stepmother of Fadesina got jealous of his mother hmm. and brought this punch to me. Adesina grew up to be very poor. Hmm. And we continue to be like that till he died. Anything he touches in life must resort to failure. He went to school and he did not achieve anything with his education. He is a backbencher in life. His certificate is useless. He is a servant to people that will serve him. At 47 years of age, he has no work, no house, no wife. The only thing he has is poverty. Poverty, poverty, and nothing but poverty. I'm, I'm seeing a cooked meat here in soup. Meat in soup. What is a portion of meat inside soup doing in this kind of a place? <laughs> Many don't understand deep spiritual things. What we are calling meat is cooked placenta. Cooked placenta? Many don't understand the spiritual implication of what they do. Some people handle the placenta of their babies with levity. Some people don't even bother to bury it. Some people even throw it away for dogs to eat or wicked people to pick. To them, it is nothing. Others who care to bury it, bury it shallowly. To us in the spirit world, the placenta of babies are vulnerable agents to attack that baby. This is the placenta of Adeba Mero Sola. The father of Sola Adeba Mero used to be very, very poor. When his wife gave birth to Sola, I told him how glorious the destiny of the baby was. He said he wanted the destiny of his own son. I told him to bring the placenta of that baby here, which he did. I put the placenta of that boy for him to eat. And he used to come here regularly, each year, 
with you, just a person. It is the placenta of his son that keeps attracting riches to him every year. He is now very rich. The boy is now an imbecile. Why the father flows in billions? Look at this blood-stained little portion of sanitary pad. It is the sanitary pad of Jumake. Sangobori, I'm sorry to cut you off. I know if I should leave you alone, you have stories and stories to tell about how destinies are destroyed here. But I'm tired of other people's story. I want my own. I want you to do my own. I want you to attend to me. You see, um, the, the son of my brother, that my late brother, that short man devil, that boy came. And when he came, do you know, he gave me an ordinary 10,000 naira. Ordinary 10,000 naira. Ah! He calls himself a medical doctor. And all that he could give me is 10,000 naira. Ask me, how much did he give to my daughter, Adeshawa? He gave my daughter, Adeshawa, 2,000 naira. For this, I want you to do three things. What are those three things? Number one, I want you to help me. That the money, that money that this boy brought will be the last money we ever spend on the surface of this heart. He should die. That should be the last money we spend on the surface of this heart. Number two, hey, I want people, because anywhere I go to, people now begin to laugh and rejoice. Hey, this is a doctor, this is a doctor. I want lamentation to replace laughter. I want people, instead of rejoicing and laughing, let them begin to cry, 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 cry. Because of the death of that my boy. Let, I want to I want to see wailing, I want to see crying, I want to see lamentation, I want to see gnashing, gnashing of teeth. People should begin to gnash their teeth in pain because of the death of that boy. And then number three, which is the third thing. The boy came over here to spend just three days. So I want the job to be done either today, tomorrow, or next tomorrow. He has to die before going back to the town. He has to die. He must die oh, before going back to the town. What insult? Only 10,000 naira. 10,000. That's a very good one. You know the practice here. We are so hard to of covenant. I know. I know very well. Do I have never entered this your... You have never brought me to this your wicked room. It's the other room that you normally attend to me. Anna. But I know that you always ask for an article of covenant. You always ask for an article of covenant. This is the article of covenant that I brought. 1,000 naira. You know, when he was giving me that money, his hand must have touched it. And I know that the moment his hand touched it, and my own hand also touched the same money, it has become an article of covenant. So, this is it. 1,000 naira. <laughs> it is settled. Get prepared to share the crocodile tears for the death of your brother's son. <laughs> oh, this is good, this is good, this is good. Look, I will not only shed crocodile tears, eh? I will shed it and shed it and shed the crocodile tears. People will begin to see me crying and wailing and I will be pretending, I will be crying and wailing to the point that I will be the one that shed the most tears of all the people. My own tears will be much more than any other person's tears. But all and nothing but crocodile tears. <laughs> you know, I said that I came for four things the other time that we talked. So the other two things are this. I want my vision spiritually to be high in the church. When I talk, the pastor should not talk. I want spiritual elevation. I want to be more powerful spiritually. I want you to empower me. So uh, I, I brought you two names. When I was coming here, I was pretending to be preaching. I was showing concern and saying love. They never knew that I was actually looking for their downfall. I was actually looking for their pains. I was looking for their troubles. I was looking for their agony and trauma. They never knew. They thought I was preaching. So, I brought their names here. The first person is Ayoka. Ayoka. Ayoka is a member of my church. But Ayoka seemed to respect the pastor more than me. 
Ayoka, 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 I'm mean, very, very proud. And you know the other time that I came to you, I said, I want the pregnancy in her to be extended with two months. Now she's 11 months old pregnant. But I want you to help me. I want you to increase that 11 months pregnancy to 30 months. I want you to have two more months for her to suffer. After that, she will die with the child in the Second person, you know, it's another, it's another member of our church. No, I didn't see her, but I saw a little child told on you. And then, um, and you know, the, 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 the problem with that one, that girl, let me call her girl, but she's a married woman. She's the most stupid girl, very disrespectful. Now everybody knows that she's packing to her new house. She said, I'm packing to my new house. That one, I'm packing to my new house. She's broadcasting herself around everywhere. She's bragging. I'm packing to my name. Just with that man, me and my husband, we are just with the house. We are packing there. I don't want her to pack. When she, I, the moment she packed to that house, I want her to drop dead. As they are packing into that house, the dead body is on the ground. Her name, I found out her name. Uh, she's Ruda. That's what we call her all over the church. But just now as I was coming, I've been able to get her your name. Because I know that you need her your name. Ayuruba name is Ajike. So the full name is this. Ruda Ajike Jegede. That's a full name. So those are the four things I said I want you to do for me. Hmm. For that two assignments. For that great assignment. The Lucifer will elevate you. Ashe. Beyond your expectation. Ashe Baba. Ashe. Ashe. <laughs> So these are the names. Mm. I know you are going to let it enter your port of destruction. Mm. Ha! Go bori. Go bori. All my bori one. All my bori one. All my bori one. Thank you. Thank you. Eh, but I want to buy new One time, one journey. All you want to buy, all my bori. All of them they with that. They with that. Go bori. your food. Please go. I don't need you. I don't need your food. Your name must be among the list of people that eat in the dream. You will eat to your satisfaction this night. Oh, Jedi Kuryo, Bamu, Bamu. You must eat plenty Hakara tonight. <laughs> By the way, how was your sexual relationship with Elijah? I mean the sexual intercourse you had yesterday's night. Are you scared? Your husband Bola is not hearing us. Because we are operating in another realm and in another dimension. Different from the one he is operating. I said, how was the sexual intercourse you had with him yesterday? We did not have sexual intercourse. We had prayer intercourse. Prayer intercourse. You had a prayer intercourse, not a sexual intercourse indeed. You are a compound fool. It is almost 10 now, and you were planning to wake up by 10 so that you will go for the second night of sexual intercourse with your province. How did you get to know all this? Keep on wasting your time and deceiving yourself. There is no way our such light don't preach. You can't get help from Elijah. We study our victims. We know the movement of our victims and manipulate their activities to fit into our desires. By the way, open your mouth and let me feed you. No. I will not eat it. I don't need your food. I said open your mouth and eat. 
I said I don't need your food. I won't eat it. You will! I will not eat! You... Open your mouth! Yeah! Yeah! Listen! This is the food of affliction. It is the food of death. The agenda of your life are five. Number one, barrenness forever and ever. Number two, sickness and weakness. Agenda three, hatred instead of love. Your husband will hate you like shit. Love between you is dead. Number four, backwardness. You will continue to go backward and never forward. Number five, death in three days time. That was the dream. That strange woman appeared to me again, despite all the sexual intercourse you have been having with me. Point of correction. I have never had sexual intercourse with you. From your mouth? How dare you mention that? Cool it down, woman. I never had sexual intercourse with you. What I did with you was just prayer intercourse in a special dimension. Prayer intercourse in a special dimension indeed. What a bundle of st stupidity. You deceived me. You took advantage of my ignorance and my unfortunate situation. Huh. You slept with me. Oh my God. I was stupid. I was stupid. I was stupid. Huh. Now my condition is worsening. Was it? Was it? Now was Listen! This is the food of affliction. It is the food of death. Oh, she said I would die in three days' time. Who will help me? My life is gradually destroying and go to the apes of destruction. Who will help me? Who will rescue me? It is me that will rescue you. I will use the anointing on my head to break the yoke of the devil on your head. You? Yes. A liar. A deceiver. Oh, you want to deceive me to sleep with me again? That will never be possible. You. <laughs> Don't get me angry. Oh, yes. I will use the anointing on my head to discipline you now. Discipline indeed. You yes. carry no anointing. You carry no anointing. All you have on your head is ordinary water. Ordinary water with that power. I will kill you. I will kill you today. I will kill you today. You are a deceiver. You are a deceiver. Please, we teach you a lesson. Not to deceive another person's woman ah, to sleep with them. You are a deceiver. Please. I will kill you. Don't kill me. Please. I will kill you today. Ah, sorry. So, I will kill so you. Sorry. Let's go over what we studied today. One. You must live your life to please Christ. You must pursue character and not charisma. Many people are very charismatic. They pray, they fast, they read the Bible. Many even go to the extent of displaying spiritual gymnastics. But they lack character. Always remember what I said. Integrity is the only thing that will integrate you into the integral purpose of God for your life. Two, you must study the word of God. Read the Bible to the point of saturation. Three, you must be a man of prayer. If you don't do so powerfully, 
you become a prey to the enemy to consume. Four, move with Christians of life, precious faith. Always be in the company of Christians. Let your friends be Christians. Five, evangelize. Evangelism. Most especially, personal evangelism. You know we are saved to save others. Six, love not the world and all things in the world. Remember Demas, he forsook Paul and missed all. Lastly, fast. Sometimes, some situations don't answer to prayer at all. Prayers coupled with fasting will give you an unprecedented result. Fast and pray. Fast and pray. Fast and pray. Don't take your fatherly role for granted at all. Sir, by the grace of God, I shall be going to the town tomorrow after service. Tomorrow? Yes, tomorrow. Uh, I shall be coming here occasionally on visit. But, sir, please, sir, keep the fire of your prayer burning for me. Sure. But before you go tomorrow, after the service, let's uh, see. I have some things to tell you and to pray on. Let's pray. In Jesus' name. Hmm. It all started at this same point. Oh, I'm not a peck and go man. I'm a serious minded person. And I want your hand in marriage. And look, Jikin Jowsi, surely, if you come to our family, eh? Our family. Women, we don't allow them to labor too much. As a matter of fact, women don't go to market. We men, Go to market for them. Our women don't fetch water. It is we men that fetch water for them. Ilewa, Okwenongunya, Okwenong for shop. Look, if you marry me, I swear, it's enjoyment galore for you. It's bad no Really? You see, Bola. Your mouth is as sweet as sugar. I think I'm beginning to like you. But before I answer your question, before I give you my final answer, I have some questions for you. I'm all ears. Go ahead. Alright. Question number one. Will you love me with the all of your heart? I mean, will you give me your unconditional love? Ah, uh, sure. 100% sure. Alright, question number two. Will I be the only woman you marry? <laughs> oh my god. What a question. Okay, let me prove it to you. What are you seeing? You can see that I'm standing on a bare ground. Ah! Only Lemo Josi, I swear, may thunder strike me dead if I have an affair with another woman except you. Ah, you don't know, you are the only cockroach in my cupboard. You are the only mosquito in my net, the only sugar in my tea, and you will be forever. Forever, forever, I swear. Ah! Then you have me forever. Wow! <laughs> what did you say? I said you have me forever. <laughs> 
God. God. Ah! Wow. Wow. God. If this is a dream, please don't let me wake up from it. Don't let me wake up from a dream. Ah. <laughs> Ooh, I have it forever. I have it forever. But three days after my marriage with you, Bola. I can see that you're looking surprised. Yes, this is a young, beautiful lady. Her name is Rike. As a matter of fact, she'll be moving in here as my second wife by the end of this month. What? How? Honey, why? I made a mistake not to have investigated you before marrying you. <sighs> However, it is too late. You see, my investigation shows that you are empty. Very empty. And you can never have a child. You are what Yoruba call Akoi Bekbe. Yes, Akoi Bekbe. And the unfortunate thing is that your parents know about this. They know about it. So they deliberately push you to me, knowing that you are nothing but a liability to any man. However, I will not drive you out of my house. I will literally substitute and replace your position with this beautiful time cell. So once more for information, my name is Rike, my second wife. <laughs> hey, all this crew that is here will not save you. My beautiful wife. Let's go, let's go inside here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hmm. Who shall save me? Who shall deliver me? A day to die. My parents could not save me. My siblings did their best, but they could not save me. Hmm. My, my prophet could not save. You all things are possible. I heard that you are the Alpha and Omega. I heard that you are the beginning and the end. The first and the last. My daughter, what do you want me to do for you? Baba, it's about my lecturer, Professor Ekuma Kwari. My results show that I will fail a semester. I went to him to plead with him. But all my pleading fell on deaf ears. He stuck to his gun that he won't help me until he slept with me. Baba, but that evil man did not pass me after sleeping with him severally. Baba, I am empty. It was a big wound in my heart. Ah, ah. Oh my God. Okay. What do you want me to do for him? Baba. I want you to punish him. To punish him? Mm. Do you know that? Do you know that? Where is your article of covenant? Huh? Article of covenant? I am prepared for that. I understood that you always ask for article of covenant. Baba, this is the condom that you used to sleep with. What did you call his name? His name is Ikumapa Iduro Jaye. Mm -hmm. This is more than sufficient. Okay. Excuse me. Alabate, 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 ok, 
akari akari ogbona bi elegun sapana sapana okuku gbona elegun e lo gbona ibe yin esu la du ogiri oku obe elegun sunku keru obe elegun elegun sunku la ro yin seje akari sugba nduru ekuro lologa nta sugba nduru ekuro lologa nta sugba nduru ekuro lologa nta alapate o alapate o alapate o mo gbe o ise kan mo gbe wa ai o didi emi o didi emi mo mu wa fun o mo fe ko lo ba mo lo si odo professor iku mo pa yi bu o jaye o ti si se o ti si so o ti si wa hu n to si ku na ni pe ko ku oduke pe ko mu ku o ko lo ma ba won ebora je o ko lo ma ba won ebora je o di ojo ta ba ri pe loju o ma yan ta ri ipa ko mi ra ta wa ri omo we re leyin ejo ta ri run mu kuru so ta ri kese irinrin to fe gesin lai ni kun mo to to di po ni sugba se se iku ti pa kun mo gba yi o le du o jaye iku ti pa kun mo gba yi o le du o jaye sugba nuru ekuro lo loja nta sugba nuru ekura lo lo janta sugba nuru ekura lo lo janta sugba nuru ekura lo lo janta keke 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 ekura lo lo janta sugba nuru 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 ekura lo lo janta Ah, my daughter, I've killed you. Ah, today, by the time you get back to the campus, hmm, you will be welcomed with crying, wailing, gnashing of teeth, lamentation of people because of his death. Papa, who? You come up by you, grow your your lecturer. Ha, ha. Papa, I didn't ask you to kill him now. I only said you should punish him. His punishment might be a demotion or, or even how at most let him lose his job. Papa, I didn't ask you to kill him. Papa, get real, Mogu. Don't be left for. That is my wicked room. Anybody's name that enters my wicked room must have wicked. Consequences. I didn't have to kill him. I didn't have to kill him. Oh, God, God, I should not have been here. Hmm. Tomorrow is Sunday. And this boy wants to travel to town after the service tomorrow. But he must die today. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the sanctuary. And have praise him with the timbre and dance. Praise him with strange instruments and organs. Praise him upon the loud cymbals. Praise him upon the high sounding cymbal. Praise the Lord. Let everything that has breath. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Let everything that has praise bread praise, praise the, the Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Let everything that has bread, bread praise, praise the, the Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> ah. Um, Candidate, I like the way you read your Bible. I like the way you read your Bible and the way you pray. Honestly, as a matter of fact, your prayer life and your Bible study life have been a challenge to me. How I wish that I carried the same or the kind of fire 
and the spirit that you carry. All glory be to the Lord. I just pray we all be like Jesus. Amen. Yeah. What is the problem? The sharp pain in my stomach. I know it could not be anything so serious. Is there? Ah. Yeah! Ah. Yeah! Ah. Yeah! Ah. Yeah! 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 Hmm. This is great. He is about to die in the hospital. Huh? Let me quickly excuse myself. So that... I will not witness his death. Hmm. This thing, next time, you will not brag that you are a medical doctor. You will not threaten to pull down my house, the house I built with my sweat. Hmm. Who is this? Can this be him? Can this be something? No, this can never be something. It must be his ghost. It must be his ghost. It can never be something. This can never be something. I'm back on your feet. Good afternoon, Daddy. I'm back. You're back on your feet. How did it happen? Ah, Jesus. I'm you, back. You, you frightened me. Ah, I don't be frightened, Daddy. Actually, I actually took um, permission from the hospital to come home and prepare your meal. I was told that. I must have eaten the stale food. I remember the beans I had some hours back. They stay still in my mouth. I did not put my mouth there. Uh, it means now that the food that is on, that I'm preparing, you can now go, finish it, okay. and eat it. Okay. You have to go to some uh, uh, Where are you going, Daddy? No, I have to go to some Oh, okay, you, uh, I will take care of the food. Yes, yeah. I will take care of the food. I, want to okay, I have to get to some very, very fast. There's no problem. Some Goboli have been looking for you all over the place. I went to your house, you were not in your house. I searched everywhere for you. In fact, it's one small boy that told me that he saw you pass through this way. Sorry, I went to Iguaje. Yes, to look for these uh, leaves. Because you know this uh, rich man? Aremu? Chief Aremu? Yes, Chief Aremu. <laughs> that rich man, he must die today. His money. Yes. But anyway, that is not even my problem now. What's your problem? My problem is my boy. That boy. The boy is still alive. As a matter of fact, all the things that you say I should do, I did it. And that boy is still hale and hearty. He's very strong. He's not only. He's not only. He's not only alive. He's not only healthy. He's hale and hearty. That's your charm. What you told me it did not work. No, 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 no. Don't say that. It worked. It didn't work. It worked. The boy is here and hearty. The boy is not yet dead. It didn't work. It didn't work. Ah, don't do it. It didn't work. It didn't work. What will happen is this. You have to, you have to go back home now and get me his on this. Bring it to me. Here we die! Here we die! Here we swallow die! 
Yeah. If your name enter to my wicked room, then you will die. If spiritual power cannot kill you, this is power to Samson! Samson! Yes, Dad? Yeah, my boy, how are you? Fine, sir. Sit down. Uh, I can see you are preparing seriously to go back to town. Yes, mommy. Uh, but uh, I, I, I felt I should never leave this place. I should mm. be here permanently. Uh, honestly, uh, you are such a nice father. Daddy, I enjoyed every bit of my stay here. The same thing here. Sincerely speaking to me, and I know that your elder sister and everybody here, it's as if we should not, we should not go back again. We have enjoyed you so, so, so much. You are such a wonderful woman. <laughs> we love you. We, we enjoy you. We enjoy you. Uh, it's as if you should be with us forever. But I just need to go back. Yes, you need to go. You need to go. And um, so I want to discuss something with you before we go. Um, I also want us to share the scriptures together. But before even sharing that together, I want to show you something. Ah, yes, I want to bring something to you. I can shoot. Yes, just hold on. Yes. <laughs> God, this is your hand. I have just poured Gamalin 20 into his drink. This will be his death. Samson, Samson. I want to smile. Yes, Dad. You don't need to go to this extent of expenditure to please me. Ha -ha! Daddy, oh, we've celebrated these things. We have celebrated it. Ah, we are still celebrating. Daddy, but this is too much. Ah -ha! <laughs> this is too much, Daddy. No, no, no. Uh, we have not celebrated anything. This is the time for us to celebrate. We need an object of celebration. And that is the wine I bought. Now we we'll use it to celebrate. It and uh, you see, let me do the little I can do. Before I go, before I go to meet my father. Before I go back home, let me do the little I can do for you, my son. Ah, no, 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 no. No. Ah, no, daddy. God is not taking you home now. Ah, you will live long to enjoy all the fruit of your labor. Okay. You does what you are saying. I, 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 I'm on my seat. <laughs> yes, um, my my son, a medical doctor. Eh? You are just you are full of surprises. Yes, I want it that way. <laughs> to make you happy. Oh my God! 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 Oh you know, I, I, I'm not used to this lady, but I have to bear because of you. In fact, you, 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 you don't know how I'm feeling. Honestly, daddy, uh, if, if I have my child, I should say that I should not do this. But uh, oh, no. since uh, this will make you happy, I have no, I have no joy. It's my little girl saying thank you. Oh, now let's thank God, let's thank God. I thank God for giving you to <laughs> Daddy, daddy. <laughs> I should even serve you first. Uh, it's me that's supposed to be doing this, but since you have decided to, to do that, so that I won't deny you what you want. <laughs> we need to celebrate this with, with cheers, okay? Mm. Mm. <laughs> In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, cheers! <laughs> Yes, but you see, before before we, we 
we take this. Um, I mean, I want us to, I want you to do something. Because the word of God is very important. Please, I want you to go to my room, you see my Bible there, and also remember to bring your own Bible. No problem, sir. Yes. Okay, sir. Remember to bring your own Bible. No problem, sir. Yeah. I'm coming, Daddy. Yes. <sighs> Daddy, daddy. Oh, mommy, oh, what? Daddy, daddy. Oh, mommy, oh, what? Daddy, daddy. <laughs> Samson! Daddy! Didn't you see the Bible? I've seen it, I've seen it, Daddy. Bring it. Ah. Ah, as I was checking your Bible, it's all came to my mind. I said, I have a father that can never fail me. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes, there's a father that can never fail. Honestly. Yes, your, your heavenly father will never fail. Can never fail you. And me, my, your physical my father, father can, can never, never fail you. you. <laughs> One smallest cheer to this thing. God ah. is great and beautiful and wonderful. Hello, my brother. Hello, sir. Uh, I have a word for you from the Lord. Okay. The Lord says that as we go to the town, always watch and pray for your enemy, the devil. Walk it about like a roaring lion seeking whom he may devour. The bottom line is this. In anything you do, always watch and pray. Watch and pray. <sighs> yes, sir. Thank you, sir. God bless you, my brother. It's well with you. Uh, uh, who, who was that? Uh, it's my pastor, sir. You and this is your pastor, eh? eh? You love yourself so, so much. And that is why I've been telling you, you know, you love yourself is good, but you know, my church, do we have abundant of love and people show love to each other a lot in my church and that is why i've been asking you to come to our church but you will not come you refuse you talk to your god that you are going to continue to attend your church even when you these few days of coming you should have attended our church you are always telling me that your pastor is hot yes daddy my pastor is very hot no it's no no hot. my pastor is very very hot hot very powerful pastor <laughs> Daddy, my pastor is fire. In fact, he's hotter than fire. My pastor is very hot. Too much, too hot for the devil and his demon to handle. My, my own pastor is a bundle of fire. <laughs> <laughs> if your pastor is a bundle of fire, then my own pastor is a gross of fire. My own pastor is hotter than your pastor. <laughs> Daddy, my own pastor is fire. Okay, do do. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you want to drink it? If you drink it, I will cut off your head. Daddy, Daddy. I will kill you. Yeah, Daddy. You, you call yourself a Christian, but you are a foolish Christian, unwise Christian. Naive Christian, you are nothing but a God Christian. Your pastor is hot, but you are as good like the drink you are about to drink. You are not. Come again. Don't do him. You want to run to your friend's wicked room for more power? Try it and watch your head dancing on the floor. <laughs> you, you, you are indeed a madman because I don't know what you are talking about. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I'm a madman. <laughs> Akas. 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 <laughs> no. Ah! 
Arvid! <risos> Akas! Akas! Arvid! Arvid! Nah! Drink the whole content! Enoch! Drink it! Off your head before the kind of fire. Ah, please, please, don't, 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 don't. Uh, 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 I'm begging you. Why? Please, don't let me drink it. Please, don't let me drink it. Don't. No, don't let me drink it. Wait, wait, wait. wait. You see, there is poison in it. I put Gamali 20 in it so that he will drink and die. Please. please Daddy. Please. Please. Daddy. please I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm about the wicked room. I, 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 I don't know anything about it. How about the wicked room? There's a wicked room. There's a wicked room. In, in the house of my friend. There's a wicked room in the house of my friend, uh, Zongopoli, where destinies of people are truncated and destroyed. Where people buy destinies and exchange destinies. There is, a, there, is, there is a terrible room. Any name that enters that wicked room, that name, that person is already destroyed. The destiny is destroyed. Uh, as a matter of fact, I took his own name there. Daddy. Too, and the name of many other people. Daddy. Please, please forgive me. Ah, ah. Please, please, forgive me. Please, 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 I'm very sorry. It's the devil. It's not my devil. case. It's the devil. devil. <laughs> and my case for power. I wanted more you, power, power. That is why. Please. You that we go up to a place, preaching to all, not knowing you are responsible for your own woes. You are the great snake under the green grass, torturing and tormenting lives. All in the name of Jesus. Who will ever believe that this man can do this? Huh? You are wicked. This man is a wicked man. Shame on you. He deserves to die. Please don't. He deserves to die. Yes. Loving him will not be painful enough. He will die quickly. Let's burn him alive. Let's burn him alive. Better, better, better. Better. Ah, Let me go and get petrol and, ah, and matches. Yeah. Please, don't do this to my daddy. Ah, please, bring please. Bring tire. Ah, 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 don't kill my father. Don't kill my father. Stop. Don't do that. Jesus did not come to destroy or to kill. But to give abundant life. The handiwork of God must not be destroyed. Jesus has come to save life. For all men have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. Who among you have never sinned? You? Have you never sinned? What of you? What of you? What of you? Are you all ready? To give your life to Christ? You want to make him the Lord and Savior of your life? Signify by raising your hand. Raise your hand. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. I heard that you are powerful. I heard that with you there is nothing impossible. I want you to deliver me from the spirit of perplexity, 
barrenness, sickness, and death. Baba, please have mercy on me. What a pity. I can't save you. I can't help you. I cannot deliver you. Ah! Modaro, who will help me? Ah, who will be like go from here? Ah, where, who are you? Baba, who are you? I am not Sankubori. Really? I'm a new creature. A royal priesthood. I'm a brand new man. All things have passed away in my life about an hour ago. So nobody you used to know died about an hour ago. Hmm? This is a new Sangobori, a brand new man. I met a power that is bigger and stronger than my power. I met Jesus. You? How? The heart is the Lord's and the fullness therein. The Bible says, Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be lifted, the everlasting doors. And the King of Glory shall come in. King of Glory, come in. King of Glory, come in. King of Glory, come in to destroy. Come in to deliver. King of Glory, come in to set the captives free. Come in to break yokes, Asian yokes, Asian yokes, Asian yokes. Be broken in Jesus' name. King of glory, come in. Reflect. Reflect. I can see you. The blood of Jesus. I can see you. That all these things that you are thinking that they are working, they are nothing. They are useless. They are powerless. All these things. All these things. They are powerless. They are powerless. Hey, please help me. I can't see. You will see. You will see the light of Jesus. And see now in the name of Jesus. We friend. I can see you. Ah, I can see. Are you ready to give your life to Jesus Christ now? Ah, to accept him as your Lord and your Savior. Ah, what are you still saying? I'm ready. You are ready? I'm ready. Hallelujah. I'm ready. Praise the Lord. We'll go. Lay down and let's pray. Who will help me? Where will I go from here? I saw the light of Jesus. And I became brown me man. I was actually waiting for you. I knew you were coming. And I was actually waiting for you to accept Jesus. He will not only save you from sin, he will deliver you from the yoke of Satan, from the yoke of enemy. He will deliver you from the yoke of barrenness. See, all this what we are seeing, they are they are useless and worthless. They are useless. Are you ready to surrender your life to Jesus? I am ready. I am very, very ready. Have you prepared your things? Bola told you in the morning that today we mark your last day in this bedroom. He didn't tell me that. Who is he? The one who gave his life in exchange of my life. The king of glory that always comes in each time is invited in. Why are you relaxing and sleeping? You should be lamenting by now. Don't you know that you are dying tomorrow? I shall not die, but rather live.
to declare the words of the Lord. I shall not lament, but laugh for all he has done for me. Who is he? Is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, the great lion of the tribe of Judah, the big snake that swallowed up the small snakes of the Egyptian magician, the lily of the valley, the bright and morning star, <laughs> the top person in the furnace of fire, and the only stone in the quiver of David. Enough! Why are you screaming? Hope you are not screaming at me. You are screaming at yourself. You are nothing but an empty barren which makes the loudest noise. Get up! Fall down and die! Who? You! I will teach you a very bitter lesson today. The King of Glory! King of Glory! King of Glory! Please, please, don't call that name. Please, 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 please. Can I go now? You can go, but never you come back into this room again. reveal your identity. Please, don't let me reveal my identity. Who are you? Tell me who are you or fire will burn you right away. Uh, um, 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 um. I am Romaka. Romake. Bola. Romake. Bola. Ah. What is Romake doing in my room? In the middle of the night. Ha. Ah. Romake. Eh? What are you looking for? Huh? I am Romake. I am responsible for all the wars that is befalling your house. Ah! You, you are innocent. Your husband is the cause of attack to this family. I bought it for you three times. I almost died. Due to the complication of my abortion that I did for you. And at the end of the day, you abandoned me to marry this woman. That was the main purpose. I joined the cause. To kill any woman or revenge on any woman that you marry in life. Ah? Uh -huh. Why are you saying her? Huh? I know the one that caused it. If you say her again, I will slap you ten times. I repeat, if you say her again, I will slap you ten times. Look at me. Look at me. Uh -huh. Oh, Jesus. Ha! Uh -huh. So this is whom you are. Ha! You've ruined my life. So you caused all this problem. You caused all this problem in this house. And you are still fighting me for Christ's sake. With Jesus, no life is a waste. No matter the activities of the darkness, just call the King of Glory into the wicked room. Are you barren? Are you ripe for marriage and no husband is coming? Just call the king of glory into the wicked room. Are you jobless? Are you in poverty? Are you sick? Or maybe you are watching me on your sick or dying bed. All you need to do is just to call the king of glory and he will enter. When you call the king of glory into your darkness, the light will shine and destroy the darkness. The Bible says the light of the king of glory shine into the wicked room and the wicked room could not overcome it. that you have watched it yourself, you are seeing this film yourself, the wicked room.
the wicked room. You can see that even people that we call pastors, they, they have a name, they have a place where they write people's name. They write people's name. The man of God so called was going about writing people's name in the village to take to the wicked room. A lot of destinies are in the wicked room. Hmm. The reason why you are married, perhaps, maybe because somebody has taken it down and said, okay, this man, this man, this man, this man must never get married. This woman must never get, get married. That's why you see women of 40 something years still remain single. The wicked room. Something has to be done to the wicked room. And you will do it in the name of the Lord Jesus. The first thing that you have to do is to give your life to Jesus. Yes, you must surrender your life to Jesus. I want to tell you very emphatically and very practically that if you are not yet born again, your name cannot come out of the wicked room. If you are not yet born again, no matter the prayers I pray for you right now, it will be a prayer in gross futility. It will not see the light of the day because you are not born again. You are still in sin. You are still living in sin. I just pray that God will grant you the grace to give your life to Jesus now. Wherever you are, just give your life to Jesus. Just raise up your hand wherever you are and I'm going to pray for you. Father, Lord God, these people that have watched this film, they want to surrender their lives to you. They want to give their lives to you. I pray, Lord, that you grant them salvation in the name of the Lord Jesus. Let the blood of Jesus wash them from all their sins and grant them a new life. New life in Jesus. Father, do it for them, Lord God, in Jesus' name. From now henceforth, from now henceforth, begin to pray. From now henceforth, you are a child of the living God. From now henceforth, from now henceforth, you are going to follow Jesus. You will never turn back into your vomit. Remember, it is not by power, it is not by mind. It is by the grace of God. It is by the grace of God that you are saved. So what you are doing right now, believe it, it is just by the grace of God. The grace of God will deliver you from all weeds, from all weeds, from all shackles and chains of sin. And you will be a child of God indeed in Jesus' name. Begin to make that decision. Say, Father, here am I. I surrender my life to you. Save me, grant me a new life. Let me be your child from now henceforth. In Jesus' name we pray. Praise the Lord. Now that you have given your life to Jesus, be ready. Be ready to pray along with me. Be ready. The Lord has used me to pray for several people all over the world and they've given thunderous testimonies. And I know that yours will not be a different one in the name of the Lord Jesus. So you have a right now to fight the battle of life and win. Now we begin to pray this way. Say, Father, every power that have taken me captive, such powers be broken right now in the name of the Lord Jesus. Every power that have, been, that have taken me in captivity, that have taken my destiny in captivity, I break such powers in the name of the Lord Jesus. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Prayers in Jesus' name. Every power that have taken me to captivity, Hey, every power that can bring me in captivity. Now, so that power will be broken in the name of the Lord Jesus. Then number two, we are going to pray this way. Everywhere, every column where my name is, is written. <laughs> oh, let the fire of God answer for me now. Let the fire of the Holy Spirit answer for me now. Wherever they're taking your name to, somebody will snap at you like this and you will see. It's already planning to take your name to somewhere. Anywhere that they're taking your name to. Holy Ghost fire, answer for me in the name of the Lord Jesus. I wish you would pray like that. Holy Ghost fire, answer for me. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. I have experienced it personally. We were doing drama some years back and then we went to a thick bush, thick forest to pray, to do the drama. Tick Forest, and um, I was cast as one of the major uh, actors in the, in the message. And when we get, go to this village, this not just village, Tick Bush, Bush, we saw a mighty Araba tree. And what was tied with the mighty Araba tree? We saw comb of comb, comb, tied with the Araba tree. We saw padlock tied with the Araba tree. We saw all manners of things, fetish things. To the Arab tree, I'm telling you what I saw. And one of us, we call him Pastor Moses Oshini, is a friend of mine. Now began to pull all those things down, put them down. Thank God we went to that bush. Who knows how many destinies have been tied to that tree? Please believe me. Believe me. Believe what I'm telling you. We are going to pray now. Every power that are, that are fighting contrary against my destiny, every power fighting contrary against my destiny, so I crumble now. 
In the name of the Lord Jesus, crumble, 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 crumble. In Jesus' name. I'm going to play again. Number four. Lift up your hands. You say, God, as my hand is lifted up above my head, lift me above my enemies. All categories of enemies that you may be having. As my hand, Lord, is lifted above my head, lift me, O oh Lord, above my enemies. You have to pray like that. The Lord has to lift you up above your enemies. All those enemies that are joking with you, that are playing with you, that are mesmerizing you, that are joking with your destiny, playing with your destiny as somebody you play ball. All those enemies, God must have to lift you high above them in the name of the Lord Jesus. God, lift me high above my enemies in the name of the Lord Jesus. Lift me high above my enemy in the name of the Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I'm going to pray. Another very important prayer is this. You listen to me. Listen to me. There is a grave. The Bible talk about um, dry bones in the book of Ezekiel chapter 37. Dry bones. And if father talks about a grave, he said, I will, he said, breathe unto these bones, and the bones will live again. And the man of God, Prophet Ezekiel, actually breathed on the bones, and the bones lived again. The bones lived again. And he said, the, the tomb, the grave, must open. Every grave that, have, that encapsulated your blessings, encapsulated your destiny, encapsulated your making it, and you're making it is in the grave. That grave must open. You are going to pray, Lord, this grave must open. Grave against my destiny. Grace, grave against my prosperity. Grave against my making it. Open in the name of the Lord Jesus. Every grave we have been hidden. Some of you are hidden in the grave. That is, that is the truth. You are in the grave. That grave, those graves, those graves must open. It must open, 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 in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Lastly, please pay attention to this. Lastly, you will tell yourself, enough is enough. Enough of Mary Goran being in the same position. A lot of you, where you were some five years ago, that is where you are still today. Stagnancy. Stagnancy. You have been stagnated. The wicked doom have said, okay, our whole portion is that this man must not rise. He must be in the same position. He must be merely around the same position. There's no progressive movement now. I'm just rotating along the same position. And that is how some of you have been rotating along the same axis for several years. It's a terrible wicked room. We are going to pray, Lord, help me. I've had enough of stagnancy. I've had enough of stagnancy. Enough is enough. I must move ahead. I must move ahead. My movement from now henceforth must be progressive. Say that. My movement from now henceforth must be progressive. I don't want the progressive movement. Neither do I have a rotational movement along the same axis. I don't want that. There must be a progressive movement. This year, there must be a progressive mo this movement. This, this year, there must be a progressive movement. This year, there must be a progressive movement. Even though I've said last night, but there's a last thing I must, I must say. The Spirit of God just dropped it in my heart now to tell you. Do you know that some people have received, received marks? Marks of death. This one will die in October. That one will die in November. That one will die in December. Then this one will not see 2024. They've removed, they've received mark in their body. Mark of death. Mark of death. Mark of death. Are you there on the hospital bed? The mark of death in your life, in your body will be removed. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Are you traveling? And the devil has put mark of death along the way. Then you are going to have a terrible accident that will claim your life. Mark of death. Every mark of death that has been placed with you. And he's saying that you will not, you will not exceed this year. 2023, that you will not see the new year 2024. Mark of death, crumble, 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 mark of death, crumble, mark of death. Yeah, remove every mark of death by the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus, I speak better than the blood of Hebrew, must claim every mark of death 
in your life, in your body, right now, in the name of the Lord Jesus. Mark of death, get out, get out by fire in my life. Mark of death, I won't die. Oh. I won't be buried this year. Oh. No, 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 no. I won't be buried this year. My obituary will not be announced suddenly. In the name of the Lord Jesus, mark of death must crumble. Mark of death must crumble. In Jesus' name we pray. We thank God for everything. I know those of you that have made these prayers, you are going to tell testimonies of God's goodness. Thank you so much again for, your, for the testimonies you have been sharing with us, for the prayer requests you have been sending to us, and for the seed of faith you have been sending to us. The Lord God will reward you and will empower you in Jesus' name. Please, don't forget to like this. Like it. When you like it, it will do you a lot of good and it will do us a lot of good in the name of the Lord Jesus. Share it with your friends. Share it with as many people as possible. Let them watch this movie and not only this movie. Let them watch other movies that Cabaret Drama Ministries have produced. Movies like... Um, the Greedy Man, The Troublesome Woman, and several other powerful movies in this Calvary Movies channel. Please watch them. And I'm sure that the Lord, God, will bless you. Then you subscribe. Press the subscribe icon. And it shall be well with you. So you share it. You like it. You press the notification bell. The notification bell will allow you to know once a new content drop in our channel. <laughs> I want to see you on the top. The Lord bless you. Keep you, provide for you, and light your post, and make you great in life. So shall it be in Jesus.